Alright, so this is the first vlog clip ever. <laughs> Hi, Remy. So this is Remy, obviously. <laughs> and she is seven months old. So Remy is seven months. She isn't crawling yet, or she doesn't have any teeth. <laughs> she can roll over, though. Hi, baby. <laughs> We just bought our first house, that's why we're using this blanket as a rug, or these blankets as rugs. Because I don't know how I want to decorate the place, because this used to be, this was like our bookshelves and our desk in our old apartment in Idaho. And I won't think I want to keep the bookshelves down here, but I'm going to paint them white. And then I don't know what to do with this middle part, because I'm going to put a, t a white TV stand in between them. And then all the walls are getting painted a grayish tone color instead of this yellow. And then I think this couch is going too. So we'll see how this turns out. I just cut Jared's hair. So I'm waiting for him to... Oh, my hair is really poofy. So we're waiting for Jared to finish up his shower and then we're gonna go to this food truck festival. And there's this place there that makes really good empanadas. They used to do like food truck Fridays, but now it's on Saturdays. What are you looking at? You're so cute. Yes, you are. All right, we're at the food truck festival. Remy just woke up. <laughs> she went to bed when we just got here. So then she would just fall back asleep on my shoulder. Well, she but did that with Christina. Well, Remember? She can do that once. Yeah. And, and that lady at church. Remy's eyeball of the empanada. <laughs> like her mom. <laughs> yeah. I'm so sorry, Mom, but I, how can you trust me? I have no self-control. <laughs> so cute, though. My mom and dad got Remy, a little Snoopy, the bunny ears, and this cute card that stands up. You're supposed to pull its arms, and then it's supposed to, like, fold and stand up, but I kind of amputated it a little bit. Yeah. So cute, thanks mom and dad. I went to Ross yesterday and I got a couple home stuff. And I gotta say, I like quilts better than comforters. Comforters are really cozy, but I feel like quilts look a lot better. But yeah, I got this blanket, quilt set, and then this sheet set. I love how it looks, I love white. White is so pretty to me. And then I also got these cute mats. And I thought they wouldn't be that comfy, but they really are soft. I got a matching one, white towels, and I love this shower curtain. It's so pretty. And it, I don't know if it'll show up on camera, but the little lines have gold glitter in them. I love it, it's so pretty. All right, sorry this is a little crooked, but does anybody else's baby? <laughs> ah! Does anyone else's baby love to watch videos of themselves? Watch. Are you looking at the camera? Look. <laughs> yeah, she just loves to watch videos of herself. It's so funny. Does anybody else's baby do that? Okay, so I'm going to set up 
oh sorry still playing <laughs> I'm gonna set up Jared's bookshelf that he got from Walmart it was like 27 bucks for a five book five shelf bookshelf is that what it's called so I'm gonna set that up for him while he is at work and he can be surprised when he gets home okay let's do this <laughs> Before I set up the shelf, I'm gonna defrost some hamburger. Pretty nice for 27 bucks. And it matches the desk pretty well too. A little bit darker, but it matches really well. Yay! Okay, I put Remy in her crib because she just likes to be alone sometimes. And I didn't want her in the room while I was banging the nails. So I hear her talking to herself. Remy, how'd you get that binky, huh? You're so cute. Uh. Are you ready to play now? Hi, little baby. So I used to not like this Bumbo, the newer seat, but I really like it now because she plays a lot on it. I used to not like it because the seat itself is flat. It's like, it's just parallel to the seat. So when she couldn't sit up this well, she would just, she would just fall over in it and slide out. But the original Bumbos, they have like a slant to it so that they sit into the seat and it helps them sit down. So, I like that for when they can't sit very well, but this one works pretty well now. Right, Remy? You're so sweet. Uh-huh. <laughs> Boy, are you getting hungry? I'm almost done with the pantry. I got these baskets from Ikea. Ikea. I think this is just Amazon. And then Ikea, Ikea, and the shelves back here. To hold up the little jars are also Ikea and then those are also Ikea. I keep my potatoes in there, my garlic, and I have the garlic and the onions covered in burlap sacks. And then Jared is gonna make me some can organizers for these and yeah I'm almost done. I'm gonna change these to the sticker ones so I want this exact shape but just sticker form because this is just kind of inconvenient this little sign but I'm gonna keep the signs on the baskets there I just need the stickers for the jars but yeah I think they are only three bucks or four bucks a jar at Ikea right now and I like that it clamps and it has this rubber seal because it'll keep it fresher longer like, you know how brown sugar gets hard and clumps up? In here, it's like, it's still fluffy from the time I threw it in. It's still fluffy and not clumpy at all. It's pretty awesome. And I use a lot of rice and flour 
So those ones go in these bigger jars from Target. And then this is just a little treat jar, whatever treat I made, like brownies, whatever. So yeah, when I get that done, I'll show you guys. I keep my snacks in here. Peanut butter, Nutella, marshmallows, Welch's snacks. Um, I don't know why this is in here. I think Jared just threw it in. And this is like taco seasoning. And then oatmeal. It's just packets. So I'm sorry if you feel awkward watching this because I'm just an awkward person in general. Hi, baby. Hello. Oh. Alrighty then. <laughs> You're just so silly. Here. Our friend Megan got this for us. I think her baby boy is just a week older than Remy. But yeah, she's sweet. She got me this. Remy loves it. Right, Remy? <gasps> yeah. <laughs> You like the camera? <laughs> so funny. <gasps> Look, it's you. Is that you? Ooh. You little narcissist. <laughs> okay, Remy. Grandma Shay got you this. Yeah. Grandma, Grandpa Schrader. Hi, Amy. Do you like it? <laughs> you seem to only like tags on the toys. <gasps> Say thank you. Thank you. So this is the plan for a backyard. Well, it's the first draft because I still have to make changes to this and then put it onto this one. Well, there's a whole bunch of river rock right here. And it actually, it goes all the way up here. So I wanted to cut that out because it takes up a big chunk of space right there. So we're taking that out and right now the backyard is all rocks. And this is where Remy's playset will be. It swings in a slide and then these are gonna be our three garden boxes. They're gonna be four by seven, I believe. And then this rock is actually getting extended out and this is getting pushed over so that we can have three shade trees along this. And then nothing's going right here because there's a view of the mountains right here. And then the neighbor behind us, their house starts around here. And then we're having two trees to kind of block out the neighbors and they might be fruit trees. These might be shade trees or fruit trees. I'm not sure yet. We definitely want a lemon tree. And then this is where the sandbox is going. It shows a picnic table right now, but a big sandbox is gonna go right here. And that picnic table, I don't know where it's gonna go. It might go on the patio. It'll move around a bunch. And this will just be grass. I really want a lacrosse net because I loved playing. I didn't play lacrosse, but my friend had a lacrosse trampoline net kind of thing in his backyard and it was so fun to play with and it's a good exercise. So you're always running around. And this is gonna be the fire pit. And that's gonna be the backyard. This is gonna be dirt from here over. And it's gonna be garden boxes and a place that I don't think grass is necessary. It'll just get beaten up. So we're just gonna have grass in this area. And then this is also dirt. So yeah, I need to put that over here. Let me just show you the river rock. It is kind of, it's getting dark outside, so. See, it starts right here. And there's the wall. And it goes all the way down there. So I want it to line up with this and cut off right there. And then all this is gonna be gone. And those three outlines you see are gonna be the garden boxes. I have 17 again on, and I'm gonna make hamburgers and fried potatoes. I just cut up the potatoes and put it in this pan. I'm gonna cut up an onion. I think this is bad, so I need to get a, a new one. 
I'm gonna cut up like half of an onion and put it in with this and salt it a little bit, put some olive oil in it, and then let it sit on the stove for a little bit. And then my hamburger is still defrosting. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>